Why, hello, YouTube. How are you guys doing today? My name is Smalls, and today we have a special guest. Would you like to introduce yourself? I am Overkill, as they call me. <laughs> as they call him on the PlayStation Nation. But it's with a Q, right? With a Q, yep. Because the O is taken. And you can't put zeros in... Or you can't have a number as the first part of your name. You can? No. I don't know that. I learned it the depressing way. <laughs> but yes, today uh, we're doing another dual com before I don't even I don't even know when I uploaded it, but we talked about where we would go during the zombie apocalypse. So today our topic is what are the five most important things to have on you during the zombie apocalypse? So what is your first thing? First thing is a sword. Not a katana, well, yeah, not a katana, probably just an old-fashioned medieval slice and dice sword. Why? Because I need to kill zombies somehow. There you go. See, my first With thing... Quietly, too. Quietly. That's see, the important part. See, my first thing is a katana, because I talked about that a couple videos ago with the most, the best weapon to have during the zombie apocalypse, I said the katana. Just because, you know, it's an awesome, badass sword that can kill zombies and kill animals for food and slice just about anything you really need it to slice. So that's that's my reasoning behind that. Alright, so what's your second thing you would take? Second thing, I would definitely take antibiotics, um, like ankle wrap. Yep, that's a good one. Pain meds and ibuprofen, yeah, ibuprofen just in that case, kind of stuff. Just in yeah. case stuff with them. So I would go with that too. That would be my, that'd be my second thing for sure. Just in case, you know, you get a cut. Like, obviously, if you get by, bit by a zombie, you're you, done. Yeah. You're done, but... That's what the sword's for. Yeah, that's what the sword is for. Just kill yourself. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, if you ever, like, scrape your ankle, I guess you wouldn't really need it for that. But if you ever get, like, cut, like, on your arm and, like, zombies can smell your blood and stuff like that. Yeah. Or just, like, you've, like, you need some aspirin or something like that. That That's a good one. I like that one. That was, that, definitely. All right. Third thing. What would you do? I'm going with the crossbow. The crossbow? Because it's a long distance, silent shot. You can make the arrows out of your free time. Just tear off some branches. I guess, yeah. Cut them down with the sword. But you wouldn't necessarily want it to be a long distance weapon because you'd lose all your arrows. Yeah, and then I could eventually get them too. I like, guess. I'd be hiding in a tree, so i just scope them out. While... That's true. See, I w how I would use a crossbow, I'd use it as like... If there was just, like, one zombie there, like a random yeah. zombie that came yeah. along, that's what I would use it for. I wouldn't use it for massive hordes. No, Th that's... That's coming up. <laughs> that's a different thing. All right, um, I would I would go with a, a rope. I'd go with a big nylon rope. I think that'd be good. I mean, like, think about, like, all the uses for a rope. And, oh, and I would add a hook. I'd add a hook on the edge of it. Yeah. Like, you know, I think, like, where you, like, twirl it, throw it on top of a building, and you can, like, James Bond climb it up yep, and stuff. Yep. That's what I would do. Because, I mean, like, think of all the stuff. Like, if you really needed to, you could kill a zombie with the hook. Um, you could, like, hang stuff. You could trap a zombie. You could you could do all this stuff. You could just you could tie a zombie up if you wanted to. <laughs> just, like, with the rope and hook, I think it would be so useful in so many ways. And if you ever just want to kill yourself, you could hang yourself with the rope. Or chop your head off with a katana. <laughs> Either I which like one works. One better. Yeah. Nice or just like a gun. Yeah. Gun would be quicker. All right. Fourth thing. What you got? I got a sleeping bag. Cause Why? Be nice to sleep in. Warm. Comfortable. Even though you're not in the best of conditions. True. And you also, like, when you're on the go, you can also carry a lot of stuff in it. It wouldn't be the best, but you can just Lug throw it over your shoulder and... Yeah, besides that. that, it doesn't have too many uses, but... I think, yeah, I guess it would be useful. You can you can throw it at a zombie if it's, like, coming at you. Yeah, put it over its head. Or, <laughs> or, or just, like, with all your stuff in the sleeping bag, you could just, like, swing it around. Oh, yeah. Like, come at me, bro! <laughs> <laughs> all right, my fourth thing. Um, I think something that would be really useful is a backpack. Like, it's kind of similar to your, your sleeping bag thing, but, like... I feel like a backpack, like, it's really easy to carry. It'd be a lot, yeah, more portable. And, like, you may not be able to ha have as much stuff in it as a sleeping bag, but it'd be lighter, it'd be on your shoulders, and, like, it, it, it's just really convenient, you know? If I was able to, like, sew some straps on my sleeping bag, that'd be make, legit. it would make it even better. Or just, like, tape 
like makeshift duct yeah, tape. I, oh my god! If I could, never mind, never mind. Just hold on one. Just, just get in a different oh, part. Changing. No, nope, I'm not. Morning. No, I'm not changing. I'm not changing. Actually, no, I won't change it. But all right. All right. I think the backpack would be good. It's just hold on one sec. All right. What's your last thing? I would have to go with the FAL. Uh, the gun. Uh, yeah, the gun. From which game though? Um, Black Ops or Black Ops Two? Oh shit! The and Black- there's a Mario for three one. Or not Modern Warfare 3. Um, Modern Warfare 2. Oh, there is? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't, um, I didn't play Modern Warfare too much. I didn't either. I've seen, I've seen it, though, because, like... Gameplays and montages stuff? Montages would have, like, all the headshots. Oh, gotcha. And go gotcha. for, like, eight headshots in a row. Gotcha. Um, yeah, I would have to go with that, just because it's more of a high-powered gun. You can easily conserve your ammo. A full-auto gun, you would have to worry about, like, using Wasting all of your ammo. ammo. Yeah. yeah. And, I don't know, I just like it because it's long range. Yeah, well, I mean, like, a lot of guns have, like, a select fire thing. Like, an AK-47, yeah. you could single shot M16 it. M16 is actually, like, is full auto one. in real life. Like, it actually, <laughs> most of them have, like, switches on them. Yeah, to make it single shot? Yeah, single three and full auto. Gotcha. Three burst, that'd be, that'd be pretty good. All right, my last thing, I am going with a handgun. Like, I, I like, I like your big gun idea. But I mean, like, it's it can be big, it can be clunky, and, like, yours is meant for long range. Mine is just for, like, if I'm in, like, an oh yeah. shit sort of moment, I can quickly pull out my, my, like, USP or M1911 or something like that and just quickly just, like, poof, like, quick draw this bitch. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, that's what I think I would do. Because, I mean, like... A big gun, it's good for long range, but I don't necessarily need to kill anything from long range, because if it's coming at me... It's gonna come. It's gonna keep coming to me. Yeah. Like I won't necessarily need for it to be long range. So I'd go with like like a USP. Plus, it's really fast to reload. You can just like, oh crap, I'm out, whoosh, whoosh, and then I'm like good to go again. I'd have to practice, but yeah. but yeah. But I'm like I was saying before. There's one quick thing I want to add. The secret six thing. Definitely, like this doesn't even have to be on the list because it's just an automatic duh thing you have to bring. Duct tape. Yeah. Yep, duct tape. No matter what, duct tape can solve ev- anything, you know? If someone, if like, it can even solve, like, people problems. If this person is annoying, she's a bitch, duct tape her mouth shut. Mm-hmm. If you want her to die, duct tape her nose shut, too. <laughs> I mean, that's just, and duct tape her hands together. I mean, duct you tape You want your can friends to watch, all. duct tape them down. And then duct, duct tape, tape their, their eyes, eyes open. open. <laughs> yeah, see, duct tape, duct tape is always there for you. That is the secret sixth thing. Yeah. That I would always have on me. Don't like that mustache? Duct, duct tape, tape it off. <laughs> or you can use your katana to shave it. Yeah. Or exactly. just like shoot it off with your <laughs> with your fall. Yeah. Oh, oh, that would waste ammo like crazy. <laughs> waste flesh like crazy. Yeah. Waste off. hair like crazy, man. Yeah. You could grow a luscious beard grow some during mittens, the zombie apocalypse. Shave it off. Oh, God. Duct tape them together. Yes, I mean, it's perfect. It is just so perfect. So, yeah. I'm actually kind of curious, you guys. If you'd like to leave your top five things for the zombie apocalypse, you can do that in the comment section down below. Let's recap really quickly on what we all did. I have meds, nylon rope and hook. I have a backpack. I have a USP. And my katana. And duct tape, obviously. Alex, what do you got? I have a sword. I have my meds. Got the crossbow. Got my sleeping bag, and then I got my FAL, or the fail, or the fall, whichever you and there like is, to call it. There is something I would like to say, an honorable mention that I almost put on my list was a water bottle. I feel like a water bottle would be really helpful. It's a carrying case, yeah, you have you a know, backpack. I was debating getting, like, an Uzi, just because after you brought up, like, the close combat stuff... Well, I mean, it's Uzi not like a would, fall wouldn't work close. I know, but, like, when you're, like, sprinting... Like, That's true. You can just turn around. like Stalker Pro or something. <laughs> From Modern Warfare Three. Like, oh dear God. Yeah. What would I you switch know. it out for, though? If you had to switch it out. If I had to switch it out, I would definitely have to go with like. Probably an U- no. Um, no, I mean like what, from your list now. What would you switch? For an Uzi. Yeah. Um, I would probably have to switch it out with the fall, because. If it is long range, I might as well go with the sniper, but 
I also have a crossbow. Crossbows are tough, though. You gotta, like, yeah. angle it right yeah, and all that stuff. Yeah, wind and drop, so. You know what? Oh, well. But I'm not gonna be sniping in a tree, even though that'd be a fun hobby. <laughs> but. Sniping them squirrels, eh? <laughs> oh, my God. I If I was ever in the zombie apocalypse, I'd go to Canada. Hey. Nothing ever happens in Canada. God. All right, I well, mountains. That's that's the end of the video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, that's Sexy awesome. Sexy gameplay. Sexy gameplay. If you guys would like to leave your list in the comment section down below, that would be awesome. And, yeah, we'll see you later. Say goodbye. Peace.